sell out with me, oh yeah, sell out with me tonight. The record companies only give me lots of money, and everything's gonna be alright. Alright, I haven't played this one in a while, so let's give it a chance. Alright, well this is really an inconvenience, having to search for stuff. Look at this, you go around and you search for things. Searching. It's empty. It's so slow. Now this is kind of fun though, you get to punch people. We're gonna beat up Roger Rabbit now. Yeah! The only thing that's really annoying is that it takes so long to charge that punch. Oh, You know what? It isn't fun. You know what? It just isn't at all. It's just a pain in the fucking ass. Can you help me? Go away, you horrid man. How about go away, you horrid game? Driving the car is really annoying because the control's so awkward. Then these weasels catch you, and they make you solve riddles, and they're always the stupidest riddles too, like what animal can you never trust? A cheetah. And how is this cat gonna kill you? And look at this. Th this is the longest password ever. Would it have killed them to make this any shorter? It takes forever, like why should any game take like 10 minutes to type in the fucking password? So then you go into this nightclub and you find Jessica Rabbit and then she tells you to go find her phone number like she can't just give it to you. So you go around and you search every table till you find it and then, you know, I was looking all over this game like where is there a phone where you can actually call her and it wasn't until much later when I grew up that I found out you're really supposed to call her. This is Jessica Rabbit. Well, I got your number and I'm calling just to say fuck you. I hope you're proud of yourself. Yeah, well, I hope you're proud of yourself, and you know what I mean, you fucking whore. I'm not bad. I'm just drawn that way. Yeah, well, wait till I draw your suicide note in your own blood, you bunny fucking bitch. I'm coming over, I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna kill your whole motherfucking family. Alright, well, now that I got that out of my system, let's continue with the game. So you go into the stores, and the way you buy stuff is ridiculous. You go up, and then you have to, like, Go through all your items till you select the wallet, use the wallet, and then this item drops down and you go pick it up. Now there's only one item for sale at a time, so you have to leave the store, then you come back in, and then there's something different there. So if you're looking for something in particular, you have to keep leaving the store and coming back in. Like, imagine if in real life, like if I walked into a liquor store and I wanted Rolling Rock and all they had there was Budweiser just sitting on a box next to the counter, so then I have to leave and I have to come back in again and then there's something else and I have to keep walking in and out the door till I get what I want. It's just, like, what were they thinking? So you finally get the dynamite and you come over to blow up this brick wall and watch this, it's probably the best explosion ever. Yeah, look at that. That was pathetic. <laughs> so then you get to Judge Doom, and he's like impossible. And most of the things you have are just useless. You have a gun which really doesn't do anything. You know what? I'm not even going to punish myself anymore with this piece of shit. Alright, the game sucks. End the story. I want to nail Roger Rabbit to the fucking cross.